Hello guys, welcome back to Spoken English session 5 and today we are going to do articles and conjunctions. Both are very important to make our sentence correct and both are very easy to understand. Let's start with articles. Now articles, most of them ignore knowingly or unknowingly but in, even in competitive exams, articles are the major choice of subject, right? So remember, articles are very simple to apply and it makes our sentence beautiful and meaningful. First of all, why articles? It mainly differentiates the difference between singular and plural what, regarding what you are talking about, right? Now, as in our sessions, we never go into the deeper aspects because this is more about to get our language right, to make ourselves more understandable to the others. So let's keep it in a very simple way. Now, we all know that English alphabets are 26 in number. We also know somewhere in our grammar fundamentals that these 26 alphabets are divided into verbal sounds and consonant sounds. So everyone knows five vowels a e i o u and the remaining 21 letters are consonants the whole logic is here whatever word which starts with vowel sound right may it be a e i o u now that will take or uh, that will preceded by article an preceded means it comes before that's why they always say eat an apple they never say eat a apple because apple obviously starts with vowel sound. So, like the famous saying, eat an apple a day, keep the doctor away. Similarly, I met with an accident last week. Right? Accident is again starting with vowel sound. It's mainly not with the letter, with the sound. That's why this example. Most of them mistake that he is an European. But what is the sound of European? Though E is a vowel, but the sound is here, European. That's why an European is wrong, whereas a European is correct. Most of them get cheated in bank exams, etc. with this kind of things. Now, what about A? Obviously for the consonant sounds, like a bench, a cat, right? Similarly, it was a mistake. Write your point. Basically, you are referring to something and mostly it is starting with preceded by the consonant sound, right? Now, A and like they say indefinite articles, it's very clear, only concentrate on the sound of the noun. Now, what about the or the, right? Now, the or the, the pronunciation differs again depending on the vowel or consonant, but when we use the three aspects. First is being specific, right? There are three brothers, but I am the elder brother in the home. Means you are being specific. It is the last bus available to my town. Means you are being specific. And to show unique things like the universe, the sun, the moon, right? Being unique and giving respect. The United States the almighty so being specific being unique giving respect but being very particular yes is article d that's why they say definite article right now so please understand that articles makes the sentence beautiful and that's how you should progress right so just have a glance once again before we move on to conjunctions Conjunctions. What are conjunctions? In the introduction, we have spoken one thing that most of the English words can be understood by splitting the word, by dividing the word. Conjunctions means combining two sentences or making a sentence meaningful. Right? So, whatever word which you are, with, which you are joining two sentences and conveying a meaning, is nothing but conjunction as many as conjunctions you can know you can shorten the sentence and you can sound beautifully as well as you can be understood more by the people for example 
every conjunction will have a different situation like the very famous one and it will join the similarity things like ramu and rakesh ramu and rakesh are classmates what is the similarity they study in one class that's why you are saying and right so ramu and rakesh are classmates but but is contrasting right i like this dress but it is costly means in one sentence you are giving positive statement you are contrasting why you are not able to purchase it because it is costly similarly so is different context so is purpose you are telling the purpose right so there are lot of conjunctions but the aspect changes or obviously choice right you come today or tomorrow means you take a decision you take a choice right the similar way see this very important because since as they are all related to reason right i am late because the bus was late right so this all this conjunctions basically you are combining one or two sentences after before when all of these conjunctions which are giving some information relating to time that's why you use after this match i will talk to you right so when this was happening i was not available when this was happening i was not available you are talking something about time similarly very interesting conversations not only but also he is not only a great bowler but also a great fielder you are giving two qualities two qualities of a person in one sentence with the help of this conjunction not only but also similarly whereas a contrasting situation right i asked you to be here whereas you are still there right you are joining again two contrasting situations either or neither nor you all know either i will come today or tomorrow that is positive at least one option will be possible neither i am coming today nor tomorrow means to negative you are not going to uh, you are not going today or tomorrow so these kind of conjunctions you should study more and whenever you listen such sentences you should correct in the introduction we have clearly decided that reading all the fundamentals of the grammar is not possible but listening will make our english proper right our mind is an automatic correcting machine so as much as you listen good english with good grammar you also start correcting yourself that's why i keep saying keep listening that is the only magic you can do to your communication thank you so much for the feedback coming for this videos moving on we'll do lot of soft skills videos also but to make the basics proper and to start speaking in a whatever capability we can is very very important thank you for watching